Hey, Mike with DDD Millionaire here. And are you treating your potential customers like friends? Well, in today's video, I'm gonna go through a couple different tips you can use to build rapport quickly and get your potential customers to like you right away while you're selling door to door. So one thing to really understand is that door to door sales in general, it can be a tough job, right? And one thing that happens is going into it with your potential customers, you're already going to have a few things against you. You know, one is that you're an uninvited guest. They're not expecting you to be there, right? So that can throw someone's guard up immediately. On top of that, you're there to offer them some type of product or service that they didn't request whatsoever. So it can really set you back starting off right away in door-to-door -door sales. So it's very important to create that trust and rapport. And again, all things being equal, people tend to do business with those that they know, like, and trust. So creating that feeling with your potential customers is very important. So a couple things to really keep in mind. One strategy that you can use is basically going to be leading with a compliment and then asking a follow-up question from there. See, one mistake that a lot of door-to-door -door sales reps make when they're new is they just jump immediately into the sales process. You might think that that would be a good way to do it, right? You're gonna be able to talk to more people, uh, go through the numbers quicker, and I get it, but what happens when you do that, it's gonna position yourself as a pushy salesperson rather than a messenger of good news. So ideally, you wanna treat them like a friend, lead with a compliment, ask a follow-up question to start to really break the ice when you're talking to that potential customer rather than jumping right into your sales pitch. And doing that in the beginning is gonna separate you from the majority of sales reps out there. And again, like I said, it's gonna help position you as a messenger of good news rather than someone that's just there to sell them something. So again, what you wanna do is create some type of compliment based on your observations about their home and that specific person. You know, you might have a canned response when you're new and just getting started in door-to-door -door sales, and that's fine, but the sooner you can start customizing it to your specific potential customer and making your initial greeting and approach relevant to them, the better results you're gonna get. So you could give a compliment on all sorts of things. It might be their lawn, landscaping, uh, could be their kids, could be their pets, their cars, whatever you see in their yard, in their home, you know, what they're wearing, right? There's all kinds of options you can choose from. Just make it a genuine compliment. And then again, add a great follow-up question to keep the conversation rolling. So an example could be something like, wow, those are very beautiful dogs. You know, I've got two at home myself. You know, I'm just curious how old are they? Or I'm just curious what kind of breed are they? So again, people really love their kids and their pets. So that's one of the best ways that you can actually break that ice build that rapport and trust quickly and get people to like you right away is by complimenting their kids and pets. But again, that might not be an option. So just be observant of the person's home and figure out something that's unique that you can compliment them on. And then again, ask a great follow-up question on top of that. So when you start off in your sales process with this approach, Again, it's going to break that ice. It's gonna help lower their guard. They're gonna feel that you have more of a friendship a relationship rather than, hey, I'm just here to sell you something. So again, if you can lead with that compliment and then asking a follow-up question as an icebreaker in your initial approach, you're gonna get a lot better results while you're selling door to door. So implement this simple strategy of asking a question after you compliment them and you get a lot better results while you're marketing door to door. So again, hopefully you guys got some benefit and value out of this video. If you did, feel free to comment and share. And if you do happen to be looking for a new door to door sales opportunity this season, be sure to reach out to us over at d2dmillionaire.com forward slash work with d2d. We're hiring and we're expanding, looking for some new leaders to work with us in our sales teams and in our organization. So again, if you're looking for a new door-to-door -door sales opportunity, be sure to head on over to d2dmillionaire.com forward slash work with D2D. And actually just fill out that application there and one of our team members will get back to you as soon as we can. But thanks so much for tuning in. We'll talk to you more soon.